Hello and welcome to PNN. I'm Victor Burke. Terrifying news coming in from our international desk. A freighter in the Mediterranean Sea has exploded. While the ship was lost, all crew have been accounted for, except for two stowaways, Jeff Peters and Orville Jackson. Their current whereabouts is unknown. I'd say reports of our deaths have been greatly exaggerated. That certainly seems so. Your career's been dead since vaudeville. Are you... Are you Jeff and Orville? It's a privilege to see a great detective at work. Yeah, except you missed this slice of hot apple pie, Charlie Chan. Maybe he's just having trouble believing that a peacock like me is motoring around with a pair of turkeys. Do the two of you know what caused the freighter to explode? Well, I was dying for a smoke, and it turns out you can't smoke on a freighter. So I ducked into the powder room. I'll tell you, it wasn't like any powder room I ever saw. But then how did the two of you survive the explosion? Well, we had to. Yeah, we're under contract to the studio for another five pictures. Oh, well, that's torture. That's not so bad. No, I meant for the audience. Well, tell me, where are you now? Don't look at me, I'm just following the sun. <laughs> and I failed geography in the fourth grade. Both times. Wow, I'm amazed they graduated you from the fourth grade. Yeah, it got awkward when none of the other boys were shaving. Oh, guys, this is where they dump the old hourglasses. Hmm. All right, never mind where you are. Can you just tell me what happened after the freighter explosion? Well, you sold me for 200 bucks to, to a local, and, and then I was going to marry this one until you cut in on me. And then we got carried off by a desert shake, and, and, and now they're chasing us, trying to chop off our heads. Yeah, I know all of that. Yeah, but the people who came in the middle of the episode don't. You mean they missed my song? This was the thrilliest episode I was ever in. Gentlemen, please. Can you just tell me where you're headed? Well, we've got to get back to America so I can marry this delicate flower. Oh, I'm flattered, but spoken for. I throw a stick, will you leave? We're getting married on, um, uh, What's the date? Dream thing. When the moon. Is it its last quarter, silvers the blossoms of the almond tree? It's Tuesday night, guys. About nine? Oh, hey, hey look, uh, unless that's a mirage we found in the harbor. Let's hop on the biggest canoe we can find. So long! If I said anything to offend you, it was purely intentional. I'll never forget you, although I'll keep trying. If genius skips a generation, your kids will be brilliant! <laughs> Everything all right? Ah, uh, hey, look at that. The idiot prayed left someone behind. Stay now, or leave him alone. He's trying his best. Hey, you're right. Hey, don't worry, kid. If they can make penicillin out of moldy bread, then they can sure make something out of you. Why don't you bore a hole in yourself and let the sap run out? Oh, hey, look at that. The kitten's got claws. There may be hope for you yet. Uh, what do you say we go someplace that doesn't have an extra person? <laughs> no, you, you two stay, I'll go. Just, when I see you next time, remind me not to talk to you. I'm off for a smoke. Orville, oh, no! Well, I'll say this much. I've had a perfectly lovely evening. But this wasn't it. Stay tuned, everyone. We'll be right back. You've been watching PNN, the Parody News Network.